Yo, what the fuck is up, guys? <laughs> it's Lil Chink, and today I'll be going over my three thousand dollar anime shelf. That didn't go well. <laughs> anyway, Whoa. got my boy Hasten again. Hey, cameraman! Shout out. <laughs> if you want to see the whole room, go check out his other video. Uh, okay. Whatever it's called, I don't figure out what it's called. It's on his channel somewhere. Check it out. Really interesting. You see the whole room and story in the corner over there that mm. has unspeakable things. Behind Yo, it. We we don't really talk about that. <laughs> anyway, All right. so starting up at the top, we're gonna start off with the Sentai stuff. So I do have a couple stories behind these, but yeah, we just like go through. So, first we have the Big Ass Infinite Stratos second season Blu-ray box. And then, yeah, I do keep the plastic on some of these for, uh, and then cut a hole right there to protect my stuff, you know. So, yeah, so this one I got on a sale. Uh, I got a pretty good deal. I think I got it during the holiday sale off... I think I got off since high. I think it was like 70 bucks. Yeah, wasn't that bad. Better than paying 100 something. Next, we got... Can't get back... Can't get that back in there. <laughs> but, we off. got Food Wars Season 1 and 2. Great um, ass anime. Doesn't, like, the naked senpai... Doesn't his, like, apron in there or something like that? Oh, yeah. And, um... Yeah, these are kind of obnoxious because uh, <laughs> they take up so much space. But I mean, they're cool. I don't know. They're cool though. They're dope. They're dope. I really like it. Um, they're really good quality too. Next, we got Gate. Comes in this cool ammo box. But yeah, I just put it like that because gotta save room somehow. So my first premium collector's edition I ever bought was chival Chivalry of a Failed Knight. Now, I bought this during a Right Stuff sale, and I was like, oh, no, I'm not going to get the, the best editions. It doesn't matter. Well, this is kind of what started my little craze for the best quality. quality. Yeah. But, yeah, I really like this. Uh, it comes with some extras, art book, soundtrack, DVD and Blu-ray. Look, look at that ass. But yeah, that's really dope. <laughs> um, now a series that has a special place here. Got Kame Ga Kill, uh, part one and part two. Really fucking love this, but I like how they did that with like it's like the characters all lined up. Yes, yeah, that's sick. We have Parasite 1 and 2. Um, dope ass series. Next we have School Live Limited Edition. Um, I haven't really fully watched this yet. I started like the first like three episodes. But it was really weird because it started off all happy and then it was like some lolly ass <laughs> like like gory zombie shit <coughs> that was cool next we got Amagi Brilliant Park limited edition and I still haven't watched that yet but it I got a lot of anime to watch <laughs> but it's on there next another anime that I haven't watched uh, Arm Girls Mechanivalism it's pretty dope It. I really like this one cause it's more of like in the style the Funimation ones it's oh. So, next, we have my Aniplex stuff. Uh, just two series, because, you know, Aniplex is a little expensive. But, I have, from here to here, I have Bakemonogatari, or, yeah, Bakemonogatari to Suki Monogatari for the Blu-rays. Um, this... I think I paid full price for this. Um, I think it was like 150. But yeah, 
I think that was the first time I dropped a lot of money or like that much money on one set. Kind of hurt, but I don't know. It? it was it was it was worth it. It was worth it. Um next we have the current Blu-rays what's out for SAO. Um so yeah, I had to uh since the first seasons like individual sets are pretty expensive i got the all-in-one box set for season one um it was 150 like uh bakamona got three but yeah i actually really like this it's just it has the complete thing it's pretty neat organized really like it and we have the individual sets of sword Art online season two now funny story with this <laughs> is during the Right Stuff's Winter Sale, uh, I think they're like 70 a piece. And like, it was weird because I never really seen Aniplex stuff on sale. So I sold, uh, I had two Xbox Ones. I sold both of them. Didn't get jack shit from it from GameStop. But yeah, I sold it, some games. Came through from a paycheck with work bought them all <laughs> um but yeah it's dope and then we have the movie i actually really liked ordinal scale um but yeah then um i just threw the first part of re-zero the japan release um i saw it on ebay for 70 bucks and i was like it's really dope because this is my first blu-ray from japan uh, but yeah, it comes with, uh, I think, episodes 1 and 2, and then the manga. And then it has the spacer for the rest, but, you know, I'm not gonna buy the rest, because... Yeah. On to my Funimation stuff. Now, Funimation is probably my favorite set, because it's just simple, the quality's nice, and fits nicely on the shelf, they look good together. So, we have... These are some old, older sets. But yeah, we got a uh, Gunslinger Girl, and comes with. Oh yeah, it's the DVD. But yeah, it's pretty dope. It's kind of funny. Uh, when I first found this series out online, I thought it was funny because it was like lollies with guns, and then they like shooting people. So, <laughs> uh, that's pretty funny. Fucked up ass anime. Uh, that romancy type shit is rumbling hearts. Uh, it's a pretty, f it's pretty fucked up, kind of. Yeah, yeah, I think it's pretty fucked up. Well, my favorite series next is Future Diary. Future I triple dipped on Future Diary. Future Diary is so good. I, f bro, you know, bro, something about Yandere's. Like, Yandere's is like a nut. A nut and a half times five. <laughs> but yeah, I triple dipped, got the DVD limited edition, the first Blu-ray, and then the new Blu-ray with the OVA. Next, we have Chaos Head. Weird, but good ass anime. Weird, but good. Dub is awful. Dub is pretty bad. <laughs> Dub is pretty bad on it, um, but still overall good anime. Um, next, I watched this my sophomore year of high school. Was that when you first started? Yeah, yeah, actually. It's been two years, two years ago. We have Vigata HK. It's about, uh, this girl wants to be a hoe in high school. She wants to fuck like 200 dudes before she gradu graduates, but she wants to lose, she wants a virgin to pop her cherry. But then they like, they, I guess they like each other towards the end. But yeah, that's that. Next, we have My Hero. Great ass anime. Academia. Uh, season one and season two, part one and part two. Um, and I have the movie, which I left in my damn car. But yeah. The uh, movie was good too. We saw movie, the theaters. Yes. Dope ass movie. Um, okay, the reason why I'm not getting the rest of the ReZero is because I have the Blu-ray uh, from Funimation. But yeah, it's dope. 
comes with right extras. Next, we have Hog and I and Hog and I next. Um, wish they had season three, but I know like the I think it was something with the manga, so I don't think we'll ever fucking get that. But yeah, I actually really enjoyed. <laughs> For uh, that angle, he looks so funny. I'm sorry. Next, we have an old ass anime, but fucking good as hell. Uh, Shakugan no Shana, uh, season two and season three. Fortunately, season one doesn't have a limited edition. So, yeah. Gotta get what you can get. Next. Another fucking anime I'm waiting for so season good. three is fucking Noragami. So good. Noragami is so fucking good. I remember fucking coming home from work and watching Noragami and nutting my pants. <laughs> because it was that fucking good. It was pretty good. Now we're getting to the more big titty area. Echi. So we got prison school, right? L look at them titties, bro. Look at look. It's Tom. It's my boy Thomas. <laughs> anyway, yeah, prison school, hilarious, big titties. What is there to fucking complain about? Now, this was either my. I can't even remember what my first or second anime was. It was either this or Tokyo Ghoul. But yeah, high school DXD. Season 1 and Season 2. These were a pain in the ass to find. Because they're severely out of print. And Season 1 is like 250 fucking dollars. But I don't pay 250 fucking dollars. It took me two years. No, a year. Because I started collecting like about a year ago. It took me a fucking year to find this. Damn. Now what a coon soundtrack. Yes, fucking love this anime and the. So I had to get the soundtrack just cause the fucking opening. Next we got Aquarion Evil. Uh, haven't watched all of it. I watched it when I was sick and then I fell asleep and I never fucking watched it again, which is pre pretty retarded. But yeah, on my to watch list. Next we have Dimension W. It was an okay series. I mean, I think I need to rewatch it. Because I think I just was trying to get through it just to watch something. But yeah. Next we have Bento. An etchy, like, food, food battle type. Ooh. And moving down. Alright, so we're going to start off. This is where I had to start double stacking a little bit. Uh, we have Danganronpa. I really enjoyed the first season. I want to watch I want to watch the other season they released but yeah I really like that uh, I would also like to get into the game uh, next we have code breaker this was weird uh, it was okay uh, I would have liked to have seen what would have happened next but um, yeah there will never be a season two so yeah that's just like a hit and quit type anime. <laughs> Next, one night stand anime, bro. Black Clover. Black Clover Let me yeah. tell you about Black Clover. I fucking love the shit out of this anime. Now I just got. Obviously, it's not open yet, but yeah, we got box set three. Um, but yeah, on the cover on part three, we got my waifu Noel. Hmm. But yeah, that's that. Then we have Seraph of the End. Good ass anime. Limited edition. We have Shiki. I haven't seen that. Good horror anime. We have Robotics Notes. Haven't watched it, but going to. Then we have Orange. Let me tell you about Orange. I fucking cried. I'm not gonna lie, I wanna watch it. Yeah. Pretty sad. It's pretty sad, but it was like cool in the end. Um, then we have aesthetic aesthetica of a rogue hero. Haven't watched it. Then we have We Without Wings. Uh, I tried to watch it. I could not get into it for some reason. Uh, then we have 
I bought Grimgar, Ashes and Illusion, just because they said it was like Sword Art Online, but I only watched the first episode. <laughs> yeah, I haven't watched... Now looking at this, I haven't really watched a lot of these, which I need to. So just like some smaller anime. Um, then we have... Uh, C. I think it's called just called C. But yeah, this one was pretty cool. Uh, CG made it, made me want to puke. Uh, but yeah, it was pretty. It was pretty good. It's pretty good. Then I bought Sinrin Kagura because of the games. Fucking love Peach Beach Splash. Cause all them jiggle physics with them titties. You feel me? Definitely. <laughs> then we have Dragon a Dragon R Academy. I really like this anime, but yeah, um, it's about Titties. a lolly dragon girl. Yeah. Now let me tell you about Data Live. Fucking love Data Live. It's pretty dope. Kurumi's waifu, Toka's waifu, Kotori's waifu. Fuck her. I don't, I don't, dude, it's all about that, mm, that rap, oh yeah, that rap, Ooh. then we have Wanna Be the World's Strongest, um, this one, I haven't watched oh. it, but yeah, it's about like, big titty anime bitches that wrestle, or, and do all that, then we have Unbreakable Machine Doll, this one was okay, um, there's some CG, which makes me want to puke, but it's whatever, then we have, and you thought there was never a girl online. It's okay. Then we have in another world with a smartphone. I, I liked it. I liked it. Then um, I called this the bootleg high school DXD. It really is. It's just yeah, it just is. But it's good. It's good. I haven't watched season two. Then we have Terran Resonance. This fucking anime is good as shit. Then we have Tokyo Ravens. Arya the Scarlet Ammo. Then this isn't a limited edition, but it just fit. Uh, Rosario Vampire. Then we have Seraph of the End. Again. Co Collector's Edition. What was that one over there? Oh, uh, the limited edition. Okay. So, so I edition. double duped. Then this is just the bot or the figure. Yeah. Or this the this is Tokyo Ghoul Season One, Collector's Edition. Oh okay. Fucking love Tokyo Ghoul. We got a lot of videos on each other's channels. You know what a B, dude. For real, it's my best friend on everything, on all the anime, on all the titties, <laughs> yeah. on all the damn titties. And you know, I'm Asian, so obviously I fucking like the cat.